jokes, the drama, all the long practices, the games, the shows, all the fantastic, wonderful memories. And now, we're all getting ready to leave it all behind. I know you're anxious to get out of here, out of this same old routine that we've been stuck in for these last years. But if you really admit it to yourself, it's the same old routine these same old friends. It is unbelievable that 13 years of public school culminates on this one special evening. I'm simply astounded by the fact that we have been able to survive 13 years of 180 straight school days and seemingly shorter and shorter holidays and breaks. This evening is the pinnacle of our lives up to this point, 
as all of us are brimming with anticipation of what is to come in the following years. While we should take great pride in our accomplishments, we should not forget how proud our families are of us. Their support and presence has given many of us the strength to reach this plateau. As famous artist Gary Bolden once said at a commencement ceremony, your families are extremely proud of you. You can't imagine the sense of relief they are experiencing. This would be a most opportune time to ask for money. <laughs> We've all experienced highs and lows throughout our careers. This particular school year has struck me as a time of both extreme mourning and celebration. Our student body has experienced an unprecedented year of tragedy and loss. We have lost a number of students to various unfortunate happenings. I've witnessed the impact of their passings on our student population, specifically this senior class. I've seen students weeping in the halls and hugging each other in the aftermath of a loss. In spite of these seemingly endless tragedies, the class of 2009 has rolled with the punches. We have endured a painful barrage of death, and in doing so, have emerged stronger and closer. I have never seen a group of individuals grow together in the way that this class has in the face of adversity. Playwright William Shakespeare once said, "'Tis not enough to help the feeble up, but to support them after." Our class has done just that. It is truly inspiring to witness the camaraderie that has grown within this group throughout our high school careers, and I celebrate this. I am proud to be a member of the 2009 East Anderson High School graduating class. It is with great pleasure I am able to call each of you my classmates and my friends. Many of you experienced four years filled with accolades and honors, while others have overcome great adversity to reach this evening. And yet these contrasting paths have led each of us to this equal opportunity moving forward. Ashley Nicole Livingston. Matthew Blake Lowry. Yeah, you should have plenty of time. Robin Lindsay McPherson. I thought that was good. Did you hear that? Caitlin Courtney Madden. I love you! Yeah!